Okay, here we are for the first episode of Gimme Par for 2024, and this is where the scope did its best work. We're out of Western Sydney for the Parramatta Eels Golf Day. We're here at the beautiful Linwood Golf Course. Uh, it's a Lynx course, it looks outstanding. So for today's format, it's gonna be a little bit different than what we've done on uh, Gimme Par before. Uh, what we're gonna do is, because it's a golf day, uh, there's an Ambrose format. We're gonna scoot around on the cart and we're gonna find six of the boys, a couple of familiar faces, and uh, see how many wins I can get. So just play one hole, a question at the end, and then we get on the cart and we go find one of the other boys. Let's go. All right, here we are, the first set of six of the day. Junior Bolo, bro, me and you, one on one. Uh, we've got the long par five on this hole too, brother. Nice and early in the day. Good hole, too. Ready to go? Let's hope so. Let's go. We've got a 480 par five. So this is when you get the big boys. Let's, let's it's when you away. start to get nervous. A lot of bunkers around, water. Oh, nice strike, bro. Beauty. Carry the bunker. Hopefully get over it. It's sitting oh. pretty, so. Oh, we're right next to each other. Yeah, it's close. That's safe, safe yeah. Safe, yeah. Okay, is that the hole you've come up on, eh? So, I'm about 260. There's about 200 to the water, so I'm trying to, gonna try to slap one up there before the water and then try chip on. No! Oh, it's bunker. Oh, shit. Oh! You know, bring the bucket. Spade it. Yeah, good out. Sit, 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 sit. Yeah, pull it up. You got a shot. You got a range finder on there? <clears throat> on my watch. Oh, what? It's got a uh, 144 to the front, 181 to the back. What do you got? What are you using, James? Uh, I'm going to go real soft to eight because I broke my nine. <laughs> <laughs> At least just get up. Get up. Might have overcooked that one. I think they're right. So I'll sit down. Oh, Ooh, bounce it just that. bounced off. Yeah. Good Hurts. strike. Good strike. Uh, hopefully you can chip her on. Take a drop there. That's a drop. It's off, it's off the camera. Oh, camera's rolling still. Get up. No juice. Whew. Oh. Great shot. Looks like you got me this one, Junes. Just have to give it a crack. Cooked it. That's and it's just going to roll off. That's not bad. That's not bad. I think I even call it even. <laughs> Great putt. Uh, Good weight. Found a little bit of juice to the end. Finish me off, bro. Finish me hey. off. That's nah, too far. Do you want the flags room? Ah, uh, yes, yes, leave room. It's all leave room. I'm pretending like I know what I'm reading, but I've got no idea where this is going, to be honest. Two parts for the win. Oh, going for it. But... Oh, he's yeah. pulled that. Nah. He's pulled it. That's. Hey, thank Here you. Hold this, hold this, hold this. All right, June's 1 0. I'm down. Parramatta players 1 0. Sc scope 0. Brother, just a quick question on um, the state of the play from your position at the moment. I think it's probably the best that it's ever been. Me and May said outside our probably. Your prime playmakers, front rowers, have been uh, probably the next most crucial part of the game. Wanted to know how you feel about that, and also the tandem between you and Reggie. Where do you rank in terms of uh, tandems in the in the game at the moment? Yeah, uh, well, first question. Um, oh, I'm not too sure. Too many halfbacks will um, agree that you know the front row positions have a, a crucial part. But going going back to the old cliff cliche that uh, front rollers win your games, outside backs determined by how much. Mm -hmm. like so uh, yeah, definitely an important role and uh, with my mate Reggie, um, yeah, we've had that one-two punch combo now for a couple of years and um, you know, I'd like to think we, we rate ourselves quite high somewhere up there but um, 
uh, happily sit ourselves third or fourth. I've got your top three as well. I've got your top three. <laughs> you, can't, you can't go past the Premiership um, front row pairing at the moment with Fish and, and Moses. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, that guy's been sitting the benchmark for the past couple of years. And uh, as a front row, you only want to chase him down. Beautiful, brother. All the best in the season. Cheers. Thank you. All right, set of six, contestant number two, my boy Brycey. We're going to go head to head on this hole, brother. Got another par five. I just went down to junior, so I need a win in this one. Oh, I'm going to have to make it two for two. Yeah, okay. fellas. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, that's not bad. Carry the bunker? Nah, short. That's all right. Might be all right. That's all right. A bit safe there. We'll play up yellow suit, we'll play social. Going right again. That's water. Oh, that's splash. That's an easy window. Oh! <laughs> first, two, first two holes, both water, both holes, so I'm scrambling already. It makes it tough, but we'll see if we can uh, put this one close. That's gone as well. I'm on the other side. I hit it so bad, I'm on the other side. This is poor golf. You put this close, it's almost game over already. <laughs> Boys, give me, just give me, just give me a look. Just give me a look. That's not good enough. <clears throat> All right, we'll be right, we'll be right. Oh, that's gonna go. That's gonna go. Move. Yeah. Come down. That's a par putt. Not what I was looking for, but it'll work. Not how you draw it up, but <laughs> hey, score's the same, same yeah, on the score card, brother. <laughs> Alright, Bryce has put it on. He's got a par putt, so I'm going to have to be really good here. Oh, I just missed the juice. That was so close. How many shots is that for you? I'm putting five. Yeah. I've got Texas for a five. Yeah, I don't know, Lukey. My um, putting game's not very good, bro. And it's a very tough green. I'm just going to try and place it real close. I've got a shot on him, so just need to stuff it up. That's good weight. Would have liked a bit of turn. So you got, you're putting for five, I'm putting for six. Yeah. Oh, that's money. That'll do. That's money. That'll that's do. good content. Yeah, good golf. <laughs> Ice cold, baby. That putt, that was nice. Yeah, I know. I couldn't believe I drained it. I haven't done a two putt on the green in a very long time. <laughs> that was a nice two putt, <laughs> considering where you were. Um, let's talk a little bit about last year, mate. Um, I thought you were outstanding. Um, I've always been a good player, but you've got that spark in your game. Felt like last year a little bit more controlled. Did, was that a conscious effort? Was that Brad? Was that you? Is, was that, was that, is that a good actual read on sort of how you played last year? Yeah, I just think, um, you know, obviously we lost uh, two of those main back rollers, you know, Ice and Rada, and there was a position there and it was up for grabs and, you know, Brad challenged me and, um, you know, he's done in the last few years, but I had more time on the field and uh, as I spent more time on the field with Mitch, I sort of, you know, got used to the role that he needed mm -hmm. and the team needed and um, if I wanted to stay out there on the field, I needed to do the simple things and, you know, just all the work that, you know, most fans don't see um, just to tuck the ball under and you know make my tackles and make the game easier for our halves and um, getting on on the front foot so just about keeping it simple and you know pulling the trigger when when to and because uh, you got it in the bag <laughs> just like that yeah. part <laughs> <laughs> but um no nah, yeah it's, it's been good and i'm um, obviously enjoying my time there and you know i re-signed again for two years so yeah love, that. Yeah, love it at par awesome brother all yep. the best in 2024 thanks dj cheers Pricey. <laughs> okay we'll take a little break in the episode to thank our friends, our partners, the tab. Wouldn't be possible this episode of Gimme Par without them. So, rugby league season is right around the corner. Make sure you come and jump on our Bets Fringe channel on the tab app. That's Levels Network. I can put my tips up and you can follow them. And we must remember, what are you really gambling with? And for free and confidential support, visit gamblinghelponline.org.au or call 1800 858 858. Now let's get back to the show. Yeah. All right, here we are with my boy Tracker, Clint Gutherson. Uh, tracker, I'm 0 2 to begin. Already got dusted by Junes first, then uh, went down to Brycey, which I thought was going to be a dub yeah, for me. Should have been. So I didn't want to come into you on the third, as the third contestant of the set of six, being down 0 2, but here we are. Um, but mate, let's talk a, bit, a little bit about last year into this year. So, didn't go to plan last year after a really successful 2022 as a leader. 
what are you taking out of last year to make sure that, that doesn't happen again in 2024? Oh, it's just, rugby league's a funny sport. You can you go from a grand final and then missing the eight the next year and you don't, you don't even think you're playing too badly. And uh, we lost a lot of games early by two, three, one point and um, things sort of just kept going from there. And uh, we had a few things not go our way on and off the field. And as a leader, I thought our resilience the whole year was still pretty good. We, we kept turning up the games and um, even showed to that last game against Penrith, who just wanted to keep winning. And was it down to four and against in the end that you didn't? Uh, I think it? we missed out by one one game, yeah. so two two points, whatever it was. But yeah. it just just keeping a group together. I think um, you got to learn from every year, every game, and I think um, just how resilient we were last year as a squad. We lost a lot of players, as I said, on and off the field, and just staying resilient and being the team we can be. Probably, um, I'm a pretty relaxed leader, and um, that's what you had to be sometimes last year. And mm. Um, this year we sort of put our foot down and said we can't have that again and we'll see what happens this year. Well, I hope you start the year well, but I hope you don't play this whole week. I've been hitting them well, so you probably caught me at a good time. I'll probably, I'm probably i due for a duff, yeah. so I'll lead us off. Not horrible, I don't think. Shot. Stick. Mm. Best of the day so far, Tracker. We'll see how you go in the next one, And you're going to bring out the best of me, mate. See how you go in the next shot. Sometimes it's, uh, I don't know what the phrase for this one is, but I was playing that flag over there, which looks to be the second hole. We're currently on the 12th. So this is the flag. Gutho's gone straight at it, but he made the mistake as well. He wasn't even playing for it as well. Smooth swing. Put it up, let the wind do the work. Yeah, that's the club. That's the club. Oh, Ooh, short. short. That's all right. I'll put a bit of pressure on you there, but yeah, Hossie. Yeah, just enough. Just enough. Just enough. Up and down, probably for a parsey. Yeah. I reckon you'll duff this one anyway, knowing your golf game. <laughs> a, bit, a little bit right or left, I reckon. Gonna have to hit it. That's that it, trucker. It's a great shot. That's that it. Oh! That's pretty. Oh, that's nice. That's pretty. Oh, that's nice. I knew you'd bring out the best of me. <laughs> or in. Oh. oh, well done. All right, this is for the dub. They've been slow today. Mm, I'm playing through. It's birdie putt too. Great putt. Oh. <laughs> what about that? <laughs> Here we go, four of the best, tied up, tracker, tied up. This isn't my forte, Hozzy. I'll let you get me to the green, but this isn't it. I'll take right. it. There we go, there's half, no four. all the best from 2024, brother. Thanks, Hoz, appreciate you, it. Here we are with Regan Campbell-Gillard. Mate, I'm three players in, lost to Junes, actually on this hole, the first, this is the first hole we played today. Yeah. Then I got dusted by Brycey as well, which I thought was gonna be an easy win for me. Jeez. But I halved the hole with Gutho just then, so I'm starting to find a bit of form. Everyone keeps telling me you're the best out of the one of the boys. Will probably play the most consistent. Consistent, I, I Are would you say. Happy with that? I, yeah, I'll, say, I'll take the consistency. Yeah. Um, on his on his day, and he's very hard to sort of contain. Would be Mitch. Yeah. Um, just long hitter, just straight and yeah, pretty much what you get. Pretty from, solid. Yeah, solid. I think I think I've got him next. Is he the group in front or a couple <laughs> up in front? Yeah, and I think. They've been playing every shot of his, so yeah. he might be dialed. He, what about he's, been, he's been messaging saying he's been dialed in, so. <laughs> um, worse. Who thinks, they're, the, like, who thinks oh, they're grouse, but they're just not? Gutho. <laughs> just, he, only take, he only took up golf maybe two or three years ago and thinks he's bloody Ricky Fowler and with, the, um, with his blades that he, he uses. Um, credit to him. He's uh he's stuck at it and and yeah yeah I I, I actually enjoy playing uh, golf with him he's my he's, he's, part he's of the my group. he's my partner uh, that we uh, buggy buggy together um, worst in the group would be Bryce Bryce is shocking shocking that actually tries to play does he try to play heaps or just no oh, oh, look general? credit to him again yeah. uh, he will try but um, he's just yeah he's just a he's he's not a golfer all right well let's get into this old menu head to head and see if I can get a win finally. Jesus. Sit down. Ah! Oh. Gotta go. 
That's wet. That's wet. <laughs> That's wet. There's room on the left, isn't there? Yeah. Or no. Does, is it a, water goes all the way in front of it. It's going to come out left, so. I'm hoping it just goes over that first bunker. Oh. You get enough? Oh, I'll take the three there, mate. <laughs> oh, that's not enough! Yes! Oh. Yes! Trying to place it. When it's breezy, swing easy. Still. Get up. Get up. Yeah. yeah. Great shot. Thank you. <laughs> Great content. Oh my god. They're all the same. Don't want to fucking give in. There she is. Greg Bird. And <laughs> first up. I didn't, I didn't watch it, so. <laughs> Thanks, Reg. All the best for you, season Thanks, two, brother. Appreciate it. All right, here we are, Mitchy Moses. You're going to be number five of the set of six here for the for the show today. So, Junior got me the first. He got first you, big Dewey. Then, unfortunately, Brycey got me. I halved with Gutho, and I just had a birdie to beat Reggie. Then, so okay. I'm getting better as the Reggie's a big on. one to get. Reggie was the biggest scalp, apparently. Yes. And he also said, at all the boys, I asked him who's, who hits in the best, who doesn't, and he said you're right up there with him as well. So o on my day. So it seems like the better plays are bring out the best of me anyway. Okay, okay. All right, we'll see how we go. Right, so let's have a crack and then we'll, uh, we'll talk a little do you bit about Origin. Go, let's do you want to go Oregon. first? I'm easy, mate. I'll up go. To you. I'll up go to first. You. Yeah. Reggie set me up first last time, so let's okay. see you go first. Is there a broken T? Yes. What are you using here? I'm going to seven, mate. It's seven, a, okay. A 145 to the front, yep. 155 to the middle. I've got an eight. Got a little bit more power, see? Yeah. A little bit younger, still playing. <laughs> Had a gym sesh this morning. <laughs> See if I can get that close to the pin. What are you playing off these days, too, Mitch? Me, I'm, at, I'm, at, I'm off 12 at the moment. Nice. Yeah, nice swing. Right in the middle. That's an eight iron Ooh, long. Too much weight. It's an eight iron long. Too Maybe you might weight. have to go change Watch this. clubs. Watch this. How's you know, that? That's gone. You know, you know, you know the old fellas that play comp every Every Wednesday, I play midweek comp. Just hit it nice and steady. You do. That's the, that's the game plan anyway. Okay, yeah. We'll see if it see if it plays out like that. But Let's go. Oh, that's nah, right. It's fading. Is that in the bunker? Do not want to go sand. Oh, that is dead. Oh, hold. I got oh, a shot. I got a shot. Yeah, that's hung that, that. on. <laughs> All right, Mitchie, so in the podcast game, mate, you really helped us out with the topic throughout the week. <laughs> uh, you, it was reported that you said, um, after playing so well in Origin last year, mate, by the way. Thank you. Um, you'd be happy to play six outside Nath if that uh, become available. So just say, for instance, looking into the future, you get picked in the six jersey. Yeah. How would you change your game to play with Nath in that instance? And would you have to do anything different at Para? Um, I feel like me and Dill, the way we play at the moment, but kind of link up a fair bit. So we kind of play like two sixes, I guess. Yep. And it's just, I mean, last tackle, I'm probably kicking a ball a lot more, but I think Nate's got a fair kick on him. So yeah. um, just floating like that. I mean, you'd obviously probably have to change a little bit, um, but you'd go into, if, if it come about and go into camp, I think he'd be pretty open to having a conversation on how we'd like to play. and. Um, but I don't want to speak too early, do you know what I mean? Of course. It's, I mean, Some good I'm, candidates anyway. Yes, exactly. I mean, the way Cody played game three last year, was he was unbelievable. And um, Jerome's just come off winning a comp. And there's plenty of good sixes out there. And, and there's plenty of good sevens out there. So um, if the opportunity arises, I'd would, I would love to play six. I mean, yeah. I'd, I've played six, I've career, played six yeah. before at the Tigers. And um, I mean, game three last year, I ran the footy a fair bit. So I played kind of a bit, little bit like a six, I guess. So... Um, yeah, if the opportunity arose, I'd love to play alongside Nath. I mean, any time you can play alongside a player like that, geez, I'd love it, you know what yeah. I mean? So, um, yeah, I'm very open to it. Well, all the best on selection, mate, but not on this hole. Thank you, official. thank you, thank you. Get oh, up. he's done. Oh, it's got a kick. 
That is a great shot. Thank you. I'm going to have to sit this close now. Jeez, I've got a bad lie. Is that me there, boys? Kick! Hurts. Jeez, you don't want to go long. I'd love this to drop. Oh, that's clutch! That's clutch. Wow. I got we needed that. that. Mate, all Thank the you, best mate. The season, Thank mate. you. Cheers Appreciate you. it. Good man. All right, here I am with Jermaine Hopgood. Uh, mate, This you're the last of the set of six for me. Got dusted by Junior first, first hole. Um, somehow I lost to Brycey. I redeemed myself with half a point against Gutho. Got Reggie, which he was stoked about. And uh, Mitchie just got me there, mate. So I've only got. Only the one win, so I really need this one, mate. But um, how do you hit them? Too? What's your what's your handicap for everyone playing at home? Twenty eight. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no daily handicap of nine, supposedly. Not playing off nine. Bit rusty because it's uh, um, the preseason, though. Yeah, Didn't, yeah. Wouldn't be playing much golf. At Haven't been out there uh, lately. Hit a couple of good shots today. If the pressure's going to be on with the camera on. Uh, you beat some good golfers, lost to some bad ones. Yeah. So hopefully yeah. we yeah, keep it's that. A bag. Um, let's talk about last season, just a quick one for you. Um, probably arguably the buyer of the season. Uh, incredible season, despite probably results not going as well for Parra as you'd like. But what's the goals for 2024, mate, personally and, and as a team? Yeah, a um, couple of goals personally. Um, obviously, being in that Queensland squad last year, um, that was an awesome experience. So obviously, want to go one better and um, play for Queensland. Um, but first, just play consistent again for Parra. That's the main goal. And if I do that, um, we all do that. We can play some finals footy. Beauty, mate. All right. Well, it's uh, all the best in the season, but Thank not you. on this last hole. Yeah. No, she's travelling. Pull up. Pull up. Off the hill. In that bunker. Off the hill. That's all right. Could have been worse. Nah, oh, that's further. Are you right about that wind? Didn't have the knots under control oh. there. Misread Ooh. it. It's a tough one. That? That's, a that's a tough up and down. Oh, that's travel, nice. Travel, travel. That's nice. Travel down to it. I can't that's, see it. That's nice. That is nice, mate. Yeah, that's close enough. That, just enough pressure. Uphill putt. About six foot. Go. 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 Not bad. We've got a putt off. Happy to leave it in, both of us? Yeah, mate, I'm happy with that. Haven't made many putts today. Oh, solid, I like lippy. it. Lippy. There's a bit of real estate there too. Yeah, there's plenty of meat on the bone all right, there. All right, I might have two putts, but I'll knock this one in just in case. Great putt. That's a great way to finish. Mate, all the best in 2024. Thank you. Great Cheers, putt. Mate. Thanks, lad. All right, that's it, we're all finished. Uh, I want to thank the Parramatta Eels, we want to thank Linwood Country Club uh, and want to thank the Tab. Got two and a half wins, got a win against Reggie and a win against Jermaine there to finish off. But massive shout out to the boys, all the best to Parramatta Eels in 2024.